Hello everybody and welcome to another video. So in this video, I'll be showing you my September headers and doodles from my bullet journal. So the first thing I'm going to show you is the calligraphy I did this month. So you can see me writing the word book first with the markers and then using the, and layering them to make a gradient effect and then tracing it over because it probably needs to stand out because if it doesn't stand out then it doesn't really look good. So the last step to this is just like pimping it up by adding like white things in the middle. Yeah, okay that didn't make any sense but you can sort of see what I'm doing right now and yes my Uniball signal sort of did not run smoothly but I think that's because there's not a lot of ink in there. I don't know, I'm gonna replace it soon. But now you can also see me adding gold because Gold sparkles make everything better, yeah. So the next thing you can see me doing is to use a Tombow Fudenosuke hot soft tip to write it in simple calligraphy. And now I'm just using a gold drop shadow because, I, like I said, gold makes everything nice. And it's pretty simple. I used it in my monthly layout, except for the hard tips, so yeah. So the next thing that you'll see me doing very soon is the same thing except with it without the drop shadow and it's just like not connected. It's like a quirky font. So now you can see me doing the doodles of the flowers. Now, um, the reason why I use the Stabler Tri Plus first is because I originally did not like want to use the black outlining, but it looks so bad that I had to. So I just sort of kept on using it because I felt really weird. Yeah. So basically, what you um, basically you don't actually need to use it, I just use it because I'm weird like that. But basically you draw the shape and then you draw the veins with a colored marker. It doesn't need to be blue, it can be any other color. And then you're just going to layer colors again with the blue from the pastel pack and the uh, cool blue, I think, from the warm pack. I don't think there's a color. And basically that's it. So the previous example, actually I did not use the blue thing because I forgot. And you can see that it looks just like anything else. So do not waste your time doing the same thing I did because you know, I'm just weird like that. So the only flower you probably do need to use that blue thing is right here because if you do use the black ink, it will smear and smear smearing doesn't look that good. So that's the only flower that you actually need to use the um, stay there try plus as a guideline and now you can see me drawing some leaves and here I'm going to show you a full flower so this is the flower from my cover page um I don't exactly enjoy to draw this flower a lot I just find it's really tedious and so same step as always oh yeah you can also add like those weird pollen things I don't think that's what you call them yeah plant expert right over here and now you can just see me adding leaves leaves always like tie things together, which I really think made my cover page more fancy. So thank you for watching. See you next time.